Yes, I appreciate my hair has done an absolute madness. I don't know what it's doing. But welcome back to a brand new video. Now we've got another match day vlog. Um, I didn't know I was going to have this match, but I'm actually playing for the local men's team um, in an inter club friendly, <clears throat> which is always going to be fun. Now, just before we get into everything, if you're new around here, please subscribe. We're on the road to 3K, and it'll be a massive help if you could help us get there. It's around 10 o'clock. I've just woken up, and now the reason it's so late is because on match days, I like to just not set an alarm if I can, like if I've got the time, I'll not set an alarm and just let my body wake up naturally because then I know I'm fully rested and recovered and recharged to go, and it'll give me the most energy for the day. And I've got my breakfast here, so I'll show you that. So pretty much on game day, there isn't too much to do. All you really want to do is just chill, to be honest. So that's what I'm doing. I'm just staying in bed and I'm editing. And I'm going to be editing for a few hours and then I'll start preparing for the game. Okay, so I've just showered and basically I'm about to get ready for the game. I've got about an hour, I've got about 45 minutes till I need to leave, so I'm gonna go eat now and get ready. I'ma make it known, they call me obsessive, oh I know Call me selective with my notes Call me aggressive with my flow Call me offensive even though Joey ain't gonna lie, life's tough Trying to get by, life's rough Try to do it right, it's not enough Even though you try, you still mess up But I'm still gonna fight for what I love Still gonna die for what I love Still gonna try, I won't give up Still gonna fight until I've won They say I'm way too obsessed And I've got nothing left And I'm not quite there yet But those words they'll regret Cause I've got something left And I'm not giving in I will not let them win I won't stop till the end, no
so we're back from the game. Just been on a 30 minute dog walk as well. And very good game. And I scored two goals, so I was very happy with that. Drew two all. So, yeah, pretty solid. I should have had a few more, to be honest. If I'm being honest, I could have had five or six. But one-on-ones is something I want to work on. It's very, very difficult because I'm playing in so many different positions for so many different teams to know what to work on. See, from that match, I'd want to work on one-on-ones. But I barely ever play winger unless I'm playing for that team. From Langton games, I'm playing Cam. So I want to work on doing that a little bit individually and getting a shot off. And Maidstone, I'm playing more of a holding midfielder. So I want to work on just getting the ball and getting the first touch perfect and just popping it straight off. So it's very difficult to know what to train on individually, especially because we've got so many team trainings. The, I, the number of individual training sessions are limited. But that being said, if I can train to be a very versatile player, then I'll have more chance of making it in whatever position because I can play in so many certain different positions. So, yeah, um, I'm going to work on my finishing anyway because I think as the type of midfielder I like to be, there's always an opportunity where you can get it on the edge of the box and just put it in anyway. So, yeah, it was a good game though. I enjoyed it. I pulled off quite a few skills and got some dribbles, which was good. So, yeah, mm. running an ice bath now. So, you know what's coming. Okay. I don't even need to introduce this now. It is done. So after that, to be honest, I just chilled and went to bed. Because after a game, you really don't want to do anything because it's just nice to relax your body. So yeah, obviously, I know this video is a little shorter than usual. I'm sorry for that. I'll try and make the next game day vlog a little longer. I hope you enjoyed it anyway. But just before we do finish, I want to shout out these people because they've supported the channel. They've supported me by using my code on Vintage. To buy either football boots or football grip socks and it's really helped the channel and it helped me because they allow me to create bigger and better content for you guys and by sending me stuff I can make more videos involving that kind of stuff for you guys and it allows me to do more things like giveaways and stuff in the future so if you are looking to buy football boots or grip socks please go over there and use the code TOM to get 10% off the whole store so make sure you do that <laughs> anyways I hope you have enjoyed the video as always make sure to like comment and subscribe and until next time keep training